Hi guys, welcome back to Tax Q&A. Today I'll be answering questions on the topic of the hour, Budget 2024. Let's begin. Okay, so we all know what's a budget, right? It's basically how you're planning to spend whatever money you've earned. So just like we need a plan to manage our money, the government needs it too. And that is exactly what a union budget is. The government shares its financial plan for the upcoming year. They tell us how much they have earned and where and how they intend to spend that money. You know how we decide how much money to spend on rent, groceries, uh, clothes. The government allocates funds to more serious stuff like uh, infrastructure, defense or education among many others. Now coming to interim budget, the word interim in itself means something temporary. Usually every year a full budget is presented. But during the transition period, which is the year in which general elections are held, the current government lays down a temporary plan to grab some funds for the next few months before the election. This is an interim budget. And after the elections, the new government presents the full budget. Next question. First of February every year in the parliament by the finance minister who is currently Nirmala Sitaraman. Mark your calendars. Next. Well, yes, either directly or indirectly, most changes announced in the budget do affect all of us. For example, let's say uh, the government decides to increase GST rates on processed foods and bam, the next day your favourite Maggie gets costlier. This would be an indirect effect. Now in another scenario, think of the income tax lapse changing. This is exactly what happened in the last budget. The tax lapse were revised under the new regime. So if you had an income of say 8 lakhs, Previously, you'd fall into the 15% slab, and after the revision, you'd fall into the 10% slab. Such changes could directly affect your income and of course, you. Cool? What's next? Oh, this is a good one. To understand this, we can go back to our college days. You must be receiving a fixed monthly allowance, right? And more often than not, you must have ended up spending more that overspending, that's your deficit. Now similarly, when the government spends more than its revenue, it incurs a fiscal deficit, which is usually calculated as a percentage of that country's GDP. Okay, the next one. Right, the question that's running on everyone's mind right now. It's only natural to hope for changes that could benefit us. Now, because this will be an interim budget, there might not be major policy reforms, but there could be some tweaks that we can expect. Remember the recent debates on NPS versus OPS? Following that, the government might clear the air on NPS and even extend more of its benefits to the new regime. Also, how long do you remember the limit of ATC deduction being 1.5 lakh rupees? Since forever, right? You're not wrong. It was last revised in 2014, and since then, the inflation has risen by 46%. On similar lines, we see that healthcare costs have also gone up. If you're shelling out big bucks for health insurance premiums, a little more deduction than 25,000 rupees would be quite helpful. One last thing I can think of and you'll be able to relate to is simplification of taxes on capital gains. There are so many types of securities and their holding period and tax rates are all different. And there's a good chance that government might simplify this for us. So that concludes the second edition of Tax q &A. If Google search is too much work for you, Quora is full of opinions, then you should check out Tax Q&A, where you can toss questions and our experts will give you quality answers and share their insights. You can also connect with people who have encountered with similar tax situations and get practical solutions to your problem. So make sure you check out the link in the description. If you have suggestions for us or topics you'd like us to cover, let us know in the comments, we are all yours. And hey, don't forget to like and subscribe so you don't miss out on any of our latest videos. Catch you in the next one. Budget bola man, budget. So big. <laughs> so that. <laughs> Come on, it's so funny. It's challenging AF.